This is a Care Bears Tell a Story Share Bear that's going up for sale, and this is just a quick little demonstration video to show how she works. The cartridge being used is my demonstration cartridge for these, and it is not for sale. So first, switch her to the on um, to the play position. Hi, I'm Share Bear, and I would love to share a story with you. You can read along if you open your book. When you hear this sound, that means it's time to turn the page. So let's share a story. Once upon a time, there was a family of three bears who lived in a cottage in the forest. At lunch one day, their porridge was too hot, so they went for a walk while it cooled. Quite near to the forest lived a little girl named Goldilocks, a name she got because of her beautiful, long, golden hair. That same morning, she went exploring in the forest. She was getting awfully hungry when she happened upon the bear's cottage. Feeling curious, she went inside. She found the three bowls of porridge and helped herself to the large bowl. Ouch! This is too hot! She said, and she tried the second, smaller bowl. Brrr, this is too cold. Finally, sampling the smallest bowl, she said, Brrr, brrr, this is just right, and ate it all up. <coughs> Goldilocks saw three chairs around a fireplace, and first tried out the large one. It was too hard she complained, and moved to the middle-sized chair. Too soft, she said, so she sat in the tiny chair at the end. Ah, this is just right, she said, but after all, it was a baby-sized chair, and suddenly it broke apart. Goldilocks was feeling a little tired from her adventure. So she went upstairs to the bedroom and tried out the three beds. The first bed was too soft for her. When she got into the second bed, she said, This bed is too hard. When she tried the third and smallest bed, she thought, Ah, this is just right, and promptly fell asleep. <sighs> At that moment, the three bears returned home. Papa Bear looked at his bowl and exclaimed, Someone's been eating my porridge. Mama Bear went to her place at the table and said, Someone's been eating my porridge too. Baby Bear picked up his bowl and said, Someone's been eating my porridge and they ate it all up. <coughs> Papa Bear went over to his chair, which had been moved. Someone's been sitting in my chair, he said. Mama Bear examined her chair and said, Someone's been sitting in my chair, too. Then Baby Bear looked at the remains of his chair on the ground and said, Someone's been sitting in my chair, and it's broken all to bits. The bears continued upstairs to the bedroom, and Papa Bear soon found his bed covers a mess. Someone's been sleeping in my bed, he exclaimed. And someone's been sleeping in my bed, too, said Mama Bear, seeing her pillow disturbed. Then Baby Bear stood at his bed and shouted, Someone's been sleeping in my bed, and there she is! <coughs> at that moment, Goldilocks awoke from her nap and was frightened to see the three bears standing around her. She leapt out of the tiny bed, dashed down the stairs, out the cottage door, and all the way back to her own porridge, her own chair, and her own bed. Goldilocks learned that sometimes being too curious can get you in trouble, and she never bothered the bear's happy home again. The end. See you 
next story time. Bye for now.